It was a great conference. As a newbie, Kuchipo Rachina, Kuchipo Stock, Kuchipo Real Estate, Kuchipo Investment, Development, none of that stuff. I don't know. I'm a newbie. And I went there to learn, to hear the, the stories of how all the speakers got to where they are, right? And uh, each one of them I can relate to into something. I don't have their mindset. I, don't, I can't say I know exactly what they're talking about. But what I grasp out of each one definitely hit me to know that I can do this too, you know. But it's a matter of am I willing to push myself. And honestly, in life, if we do not push ourselves to do something, we're not going to get there. So first of all, Chai, New, all the speakers, all the attendees, and especially the helpers. Because of everybody coming together, this conference was a huge conference. It was a big success. I will have to say the yacht was definitely a plus to it as well. And I've never been on a yacht, you guys. i have like a newbie to everything, okay? I've been pretty much sheltered with a lot of stuff. So the yacht and it's more networking. We had networking outside a conference too. And I met a lot of people. Um, I also met a few of those who live here in Fresno that I didn't know that were, were going as well. So lots of connection, lots of network. Everything that happened there, all the talks, yes, all great information. And what I gained out of it was everything that I can. I, gr- I gained, I would say, good relationship. I hope that I gained great friendship with all the people that I spoke with. <laughs> But I definitely gained a lot of knowledge, an eye-opener of something I did not know about it. I thought about things like, how do I get into real estate, right? Or what is the, the meaning of it? How do you do that, right? And can you do, and I know a lot of people do real estate and they do other things as well. So it's one job and having other jobs at the same time. You know, when you start thinking about a lot of multitasking, right? You think, oh, that's too much work. I don't have time. I don't have time for this. I don't have time. How do I manage this and that, right? But no, you do. You have time, all the time that you can, but it's a matter of how much time you want to put into it. And so as as I listened to Chai with, you know, I actually missed out on Chai, but I had a, the recording. Chai, I did record. So I went back and listened. As well as prior to conference, Chai had these mini uh, sessions. And so I had been pay- paying attention already and uh, getting to where how he got his numbers. On top of that, you know, listening to uh, Sai tells what he talked about, and there's a lot of great information about it. And if you guys are friends with me, then you guys saw that I went live just a little bit just about Sai talking. And if you want a good laugh, definitely go check that out because it's a good laugh. You definitely don't want to miss it. And uh, I don't even know (laughs) how I got to this fun part of it, but it was a great part to listen to. And uh, that part, It really took a a toll of really making you think about what you're doing. And one thing that hit me about what Sai talked about was sacrifice. And the one thing, as soon as he talked about sacrifice, I thought about, I was like, yes, I'm already making that sacrifice by being there. Then you're holding yourself back at the end. Especially when he talked about that, it made, you know, I already knew that, yes, I already made the sacrifice. For me to go across the country to a place that is unknown, I made that sacrifice already to learn more, to want to know more, because I didn't know anything. And I love that about, there was a lot of stuff that I talked about, but that was something that I definitely loved that he approached with. You know, there's, Duli Baku was there as a speaker also, and wow. I mean, I've only, like many of you, you, you only know or hear Thule Baku as the amazing artist, right? But he was so funny, you guys. I just had it, like, laugh all the time when what he was talking about. And even though there were parts that I didn't know what the heck he was saying, but I got the general picture of it. And even talking to him a little bit and his beautiful madame, you know, they are such, everybody that was there were such humble people. And so I really enjoyed Thule's talk, as well as Zong. Zong talked about stock. 
Oh my gosh, good sports are you about stock about day trade and all that stuff. I have no idea. Like the vocabs, the tech technical terms you're using, I'm like, what the heck is this? You know? Again, because it's not something that I do. It's not in my daily life that I work on, right? So I'm listening to him talk and as he starts going on showing some graphs and stuff, I kinda knew what he was talking about. But again, this is all new information for me to know that hey if i want to know something i can i just need to get into it and do it and you got to go with it As, aside from that there was uh, oh along with you know zong's there was um a chai's uncle uh Chihu. and i would to say it was <laughs> so funny <laughs> i he talked about so much stuff <laughs> i just laughed i had to laugh about his answers and he just enjoyed his storytelling and sometimes for us to relate about stuff, it's about storytelling. It's about like our experiences. Can we relate to it? Is it relatable to us? Do we understand it? Does it hit us? So there's a lot of, lot of information of knowing that there was a time where where they did fall and they did fall and they did fall at the very beginning. And that is humbling to know that it's not just like they had to earn it themselves too. They had to figure it out. So this conference, Brian also spoke, and I and I loved what Brian talked about too. And as well as uh, Tu and Nali, such great, great speakers. I would recommend that Yadia Lajolomona but if it's something that you're already doing and then that's okay but those who want to learn something new take this and apply it but all in all this is what the main point is that you can't do something if you're not willing to push yourself that this is my take of it in life in in general if you want to do something, then do it. But if you're going to make excuses, then you're going to hold yourself back. And if you are thinking, overthinking about stuff and you're making plan B, you're making backup plans and all this stuff, then you're doubting yourself in the beginning. If your plan doesn't work in the, in the beginning, you fall back on your second plan. But that means that you don't have faith in your first plan. As well as it's okay to fall. We fall every day, you guys. Bitch, Bolsana. Even the Ningmunya Chapla. Ku, I have to laugh at Ku. I, I took a picture of Ku. He was talking about something. I don't remember. There was so much that was. And I snapped a picture where he was just laughing. And Ku, na, Kunya, Minnesota. And if you guys know about Minnesota, you guys go to Legacy uh, Funeral Home, right? Nipo Hetelu Legacy Funeral. And when he was sharing about that and bringing his numbers, Oh my gosh, like, I just had a, a good laugh about how humble he was, how well he was um, about sharing his story and wanting us to see that. It's okay at the Yipongna, Nichen Hai, the new Ohaluda, new Sunday there. So, even the name, Munya Chapla, Yin, Ila Yinche, Ohaluda, new. So, if you think that oh, I don't have enough time, then it comes down to you. I'm in that comfortable phase. I don't want to risk everything. I don't want to do this just in case I lose everything. And if that's it for you, that's it. That is absolutely okay. But for this conference itself, there were so many great messages that I got out of it. For me to go and talk about each and everyone in like details, it would take beyond this you know, hour, two hours that I'm here. But I will say that it was an overall great turnout. A sold out conference. Um, some weren't able to attend. I will have to say Chris definitely missed out. She would have loved it. She would have. I had so many connections that I lost track of all the people I connected with. I don't even know how many people. I just know I talked to a lot of people. But overall, this conference was a great eye opener because we everybody that's 
mo luje mo because if you're hungry for it for whatever it is know that you can do it but it comes down to you can you and will you push yourself to do it don't go anywhere i'll be back in just a moment this is a song from win bing and penny zhang this is michelle for the genic show kbif 900 a.m